Shalom. Shalom to our daily blessing. Today we are in Toraja. We are speaking from Toraja to you, to the nations of the world. And you know the word of the Lord says this in uh, Psalms 22 and verse 3. A burden man foresees evil and hides himself, but the simple pass on and are punished. By humility and the fear of the Lord are the riches and honor and life. Riches and honor are life when you fear the Lord, when you walk in the fear of the Lord, when you walk in the presence of the Lord, when you walk with a humble heart, you will see riches and honor coming to your life, to your family, to your situation, to your household. Remember that the word of God says when the trouble hits your life, you know, this is the word. We are troubled on every side, yet not distressed. We are perplexed, but not in despair. Rebuked, persecuted, but not forsaken. Cast down, but not destroyed. Second Corinthians 4, 8 and 9. Amazing. When you are troubled on every side, when pressure comes in, when the situation comes in, and you are put to a spot where you can't know what to do, and this is where you should learn to trust the Lord and learn to lean on the Lord. And when you lean on the Lord, you will see you, uh, riches and honor coming to you. You know, your life will be full because your heart is humble before the Lord. Create in me a clean heart, Lord. You know, every day, come to the Lord. Ask the Lord, Lord, give me a clean heart. Give me a heart that is humble, that you and your household may be blessed, that you may walk in the virtues of the Lord. Remember my voice. Remember <laughs> that the Lord is good. Let me pray with you. Father, I thank you for your goodness. I thank you for your mercy. I speak blessing over their household. I speak your miracle over their lives. I speak their peace of God to go forth of God and I speak to Father God that whatever their hands touch they may be blessed whatever they do they may be blessed let wisdom and understanding come upon them that they will be blessed in their coming in and their going out their children blessed Lord I speak right now in the name of Jesus those who are sick in body be healed in the name of Jesus by his stripes you are made whole also remember this, when you are in a crisis and hope does not disappoint us because God has poured out His love into our hearts by the Holy Spirit who He has given us. Romans 5, 3 to 5. You know, you, if you trust God, hold on to the Word and the miracle will come. Like when you're speaking to the mountain, Speak to the mountain, the mountain will flee into the sea. It shall flee into the sea. So speak to your mountain, speak life to your situation, speak the miracle to your situation that you may be blessed. So remember, be blessed in the name of Jesus. By His stripes you are healed in Jesus' mighty name. And we know that God is able to do far more exceedingly, abundantly more than you can ever think about or imagine by the power that worketh within you. The power that worketh within you. That is why your faith must be strong. And when you believe God, God will move the mountains for you. So be able to trust God in the name of Jesus. Be blessed. I will see you guys next time.